everyone. I'm Julita Rivera, your house doctor. I want to continue our discussion of selling your house without a real estate professional. As you know, in the state of Florida, you can sell your house by yourself. But I want you to consider this. Beyond the money that many sellers leave on the table when selling on their own, you will have to consider your ability to show your property safely and frequently. As a homeowner, you will get random calls inquiring about your property. And you can't just give everyone the lockbox code so they can see the property while you're at work. Just like you may not be available to show the property in the mornings or in the afternoon because of your work schedule. And if you are a business owner, think about how much time and money you will lose when you're having to stop what you're doing to coordinate showings. Not to mention that doing it on your own, you will have to go through several calls and inquiries of people that are not yet qualified to purchase a home, meaning they haven't spoken to a lender or received a pre-qualification letter. Real estate professionals screen buyers and only take those that are qualified to buy a home to your home. This brings me to my next point. Real estate professionals take safety measures to ensure that the people that they're working with are who they say they are and that they are qualified to buy. Reducing the chances of putting themselves in danger or wasting time showing a property to someone that cannot buy the property at all. If you are still wanting to sell for yourself, be sure to have safety measures in place and have an open, flexible schedule to accommodate showings in order to get your house sold. Well, there you have it. Part two of the For Sale by Owner series. For this and more real estate related videos, subscribe to my channel. Until next time. Bye. You ain't seen nothing like this.